it's it's interesting because it's now here. Uh, well, as near as damn it here. Obviously, um, you know, it's something that people have struggled with. There are ways around it, but this is a kind of an all-in-one solution to really democratise uh, time-lapse picture taking um, and, and make that as sort of super simple as possible. Okay, so here at CES and uh, I'm on the NLAPS booth. NLAPS now uh, is it's a very interesting product. So here you see Taiki, uh, which is a time-lapse camera. When you are doing time-lapse, three main constraints. The first one is battery, the other one is memory stick, and the last one you don't, leave, you don't want to leave your camera outside for a long time. So we have developed this camera for mid and long term time lapses, which is solar powered. So here you see it's a solar panel. And we have also inside a modem, Wi Fi, and 4G in order to push all the pictures uh, to the cloud. If you can effectively leave it, almost indefinitely, because it's just going to keep pumping the files, pumping the images across your 4G or your Wi-Fi connection. Uh, and then if it doesn't have connection, it will store them to your micro SD card. So the power from solar uh, allows it to keep going indefinitely. And the fact that it's connected means that you're not going to run out of storage space, uh, certainly anytime soon. You just keep pushing it all to the cloud. We have also on the Taiki uh, two cameras uh, in order to get one panoramic picture on which, on the web app, you can add some digital effects, like pan and zooming. Now, it's not yet available, uh, but it will be available fairly soon this year. Uh, first, uh, first semester this year, they're saying. So it's been funded by Kickstarter. They're about 80% there. And uh, it really is quite interesting.